welcome to e news zimbabwe this is char insang reporting for e news zimbabwe well there's this story going around around uh, people that zimbabweans are selling their tools well this story is not related to entertainment news but it is the comments that caught our attention P- the comments people that are commenting are very very entertaining Okay, there's a story going around on social media claiming that Zimbabweans are selling their toes for thousands of US dollars. Well, we haven't seen anybody who came out and say, okay, look at my toe, I am bleeding, and this is me, and this is my money. We haven't seen anybody. Those people that are, like, in this video, you can see, uh, people that are coming, are coming out, they are bandaged. You can't see even whether they are caught, they, they don't have toes or not. You can just bandage yourself. And some people are claiming on radio. I mean, you can just do a fake call on radio. all right and that clip you just watched the guy is is saying that he now got his expensive car and he lost his toes and he doesn't mind that he doesn't have the toes anymore but the guy is bandaged what if he's lying you can't believe something like this now let's jump into the comments that caught our attention we found this comments are very very entertaining somebody saying i'm relocating to zimbabwe i mean we found this comment entertaining and we we believe that these people they don't mean it they are just being i mean everybody can just see that the whole thing is just a joke there's nothing serious about it and um yeah some people i just want to go to zimbabwe and it's everywhere like from um all over South Africa, Nigeria, Angola, Zambia, everybody is talking about it and some are willing to uh, relocate to Zimbabwe with immediate effect so that their toes can be caught uh, and they can earn money, quick money. Oh guys, we find these comments very, very entertaining and we believe that these people didn't mean any harm. They are just being entertained with the whole situation as we are we find this story very entertaining because there's no facts to it wow and that a video you just watch right now uh, the guy is uh, you can see clearly that he's is being caught and the guy is saying hand me over the car keys right now in case you're going to change your mind give me the car keys and i hold them as you cut my toe and they can you seem to be this blood there but i mean how how can you tell if it's not a fake blood i mean who would want to be uh, filmed doing such a thing we found this very we found these things very shameful i don't think anybody who is truly doing it they would record themselves like this that makes it look very very fake uh, we would not deny that things like this are happening but the government of Zimbabwe haven't confirmed this and the police of Zimbabwe denied knowing anything about uh, this issue so for now we just uh, can't uh, say a uh, much well as a news as uh, zimbabwe we would not like to deep uh, to dig deep into this uh, situation because it's not in the category of entertaining it's just that the comments that caught our attention well we would not deny that uh, this thing are happening and people are doing it and uh, we will not also agree that this thing's happening because there's nobody who came out uh, genuinely came out with a bleeding um toll uh, uh with many claiming uh, to got this uh from uh, this this ritual things it's just pictures going around i mean how do you know that those pictures that are going around are not from people who had accident uh we just uh, can't uh, confirm this but uh, to those who were planning to cut other people's toes please from the rumors the ritualists don't accept other people's toes you have to come with your own toe to-
thank you so much for watching this has been Chai Sang reporting for E News Zimbabwe. If this story turns out to be true, as E News Zimbabwe, we do not encourage anybody to sell their toes for money because these things are ritual things that might make fire in your life later on. Uh, from the people that are claiming that they've been there, uh, they are saying that these things they come with um, a ritual rules that you have to follow for the rest of your life. If you break those rules, you're going to die or something bad is going to happen to you. Um, anyway, this is E News Zimbabwe. Till we meet again, this is goodbye and stay safe. <laughs>